Hello Taurus, welcome to your love reading. Please only take what fits and resonates for you with this reading. Whatever doesn't, just leave it on out. It may be a message for someone else. All right, thank you guys for being here. Let's get right into this reading, you guys. We have a lot to get into. All right, here we go. For Taurus. All right, starting off here very positive, Taurus. You have the Ten of Cups. Okay, so feeling really happy, feeling energized, feeling like things are moving forward uh, in a really positive direction here. I do see someone wanting to surprise you, wanting to offer you something here. This could also be you being really happy with where you're at with your career, where you're at in your uh, just place in life, really being satisfied and just moving forward, just rising up. But it feels like things are really uh, moving forward and getting more serious and elevating here with someone. All right, now this could also be someone who's really thinking about taking things in a more serious way with you like they view you uh, as someone that they want to spend all their time with they want to give attention to all right I feel like someone definitely wants to do something kind here for you surprise you shock you things feel like they're kind of balancing out it feels like this is a relationship where the two of you are really considering each other's feelings dreams happiness here okay what else okay Oh boy, are they serious about you? Yeah, they're not playing around. Two of Cups. All right, so this is all about partnership. This is all about coming together. This is about being ready to come together. Not only ready, okay, this is someone who's protective. This is someone who wants to step up. This is someone who takes charge. This is someone who knows exactly what they want and they go for it. So I definitely see a lot of attention here coming in, a lot of effort here. It's gonna be a beautiful new adventure. There's definitely a spark between you and this person, okay? The passion is there, the chemistry is there. All right, it feels like the two of you have this unique connection to where it feels really comfortable. Uh, it feels very familiar. Definitely wanting more, definitely wanting to expand here. So so this person is really putting things in motion here. Whether you know it or not, this person is taking you, your uh, heart, your love, your time. Very serious here. You may be dealing with an Aries. Okay, let's get a little bit more. Yeah, this person views this as long term. They feel like you guys are a good fit. It just works. They love learning about you as well. They're always excited when they're around you, when they speak to you. It just makes them want to go for it even more. Oh my God. Taurus, what is going on? These are all beautiful cards to have. They're very positive, very happy, and especially for a love reading. My goodness. So for some of you, this may be new, right? This is new. You're getting to know each other, but it feels really good. It feels really happy. It feels really exciting. Just giving you those vibes where you just feel like you're just glowing. You're just happy. Now, both of you, I feel, have had some hard times when it comes to love and relationships, okay? This could be from the past, but I feel like the two of you are really focused on taking time with each other, building together, and showing that work, which is going to cause a, a create a beautiful foundation here okay so there's butterflies here okay there's a lot of feelings a lot of emotions are being stirred up you might have been a little caught off guard with this person or someone was kind of like uh i don't know like you know kind of being like hold up a minute just let's 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 take it slow but i feel like being open and receptive this person is really going to show you uh who they are what they're working with what they're about so I see a beautiful connection here for you. Let's get a little bit more. Let's keep it going. Okay. Okay, let's see. Now, you and this person may be opposites here when it comes to certain beliefs, but I feel like it's not going to stop the two of you because the vision here where it really counts when it comes to long term, when it comes to family, when it comes to uh, what you both truly want, you both are on the same page there. So again, it could be like you guys may disagree on little things, but where it really counts, you both are going to make it work. I see a lot of texting, a lot of flirting. Okay, this is definitely a love message coming through. This could be this person wanting to tell you their feelings that they've been holding on to. Look at this, the heart here, the cups that get deeper and deeper and deeper in this reading. Wow. 
Okay. Now this person may also be worried, worried that you're not going to accept their offer, worried that you don't want long-term with them. But again, I feel like this person isn't going to give up. They're going to keep going. They're going to keep making sure that you know that you are the person that they want to be with here. There's a lot of feelings that this person has for you, especially if they haven't told you, if they haven't said the, uh, the, I love you. I'm telling you, this person is already starting to feel and go through these emotions here. This is someone who is really emotionally balanced, Taurus, okay? So you don't even have to worry about that. They have a, a, a really nice temperament here. And I feel like they're also very gentle and very loving and very patient. I feel like the both of you do have concerns because uh, concerns about, you know, going through that hardship again and just wanting to make sure that the both of you are taking it at a pace that you both feel is right. So I definitely see a lot of time, a lot of effort here and something being built with that time, with that energy here into something beautiful, to something long-term. Now let's get a little bit more. So you have Pisces here. Aries coming through very strong and Pisces coming through for you. So let's, let's get a little bit more. Okay. Let's see. Yeah. This person likes you. A romance is blooming They're, right now. It's fun right now. It's exciting right now. It may just be a lot of texting and calls, but again, they're already, they're in it. They like you. They already have feelings here. They're already thinking ahead. They're already trying to do what they need to do to set those things in motion here to be with you. Oh, transcending obstacles, learning, expansion, preparing for union. There's beautiful growth here, right? That elevation, that moving forward, progressing, rebuilding, repetitive, persistent. Someone here may want to work on things and they're very worried uh, that... You may be wanting to give up the good fight here, but this person knows that even though you guys are going through hardship, some of you might feel really alone or your person feels very alone, but they know that they want to work on things. Okay. Even if they have to build again from the ground up, I feel like the foundation here is what's most important. Uh, it's like, this is what's on this person's mind. It's what they feel. It's what they're trying to do. They want to build. They want it to work. They want to hold on to that passion, that spark that they have for you. Doesn't matter what they have to do. Doesn't matter what they have to go through or hear the same things. They want to work on it. All right, let's see. For Taurus. Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type. Yeah, I feel like you guys are opposites here. Just different. But it just makes it more exciting. Keep an open mind. I, I do feel like a lot of you with this person that you're dating or that's into you, at first, you guys are going to be really hesitant. At first, you guys are going to kind of give them the, the run around here and be like, mm, I'm not feeling it. But this person isn't going to give up. This person is going to show you uh, <laughs> uh, how to be consistent how to put in that work, how to not give up on what it is that you want. Now, someone needs to heal family issues here. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents, okay? So there may be some drama going on here within the family, someone who's trying to chime in, someone who likes to gossip, someone who's causing issues here, causing a rift between you and your person. So I feel like there's some deep rooted family issues here that are causing a lot of stress, a lot of obstacles, but this person does not want it to get in the way, even though it may have already. So again, it's like, what do we need to tear down to rebuild the way we need to rebuild it for us, right? Without someone chiming in here. Someone may be trying to sabotage this connection. Like they don't want your person to be with you. Someone may be jealous here. Oh, okay. Let's see. Let's get a little bit more here for Taurus. Karma. A lot of things in motion here. 
there's been a lot that's transpired between you and this person. And it's, again, I feel like it's created a lot of smoke. It's created a lot of confusion. It's created a lot of hard times, but it's almost like this person who was creating this. Okay. For those of you who resonate with someone who's jealous or either chiming in causing issues, it's like this person is going to be found out. Ah, oh, look how serious it is. Marriage, right? Preparing for union. This is a part of the ascending here for you, Taurus. This is very serious. There's the feelings. There's those deep, deep cups I keep talking about, right? <laughs> All these cups popping up in your reading. So a lot of feelings. Again, a lot of emotions. This person has so much that they just want to pour. Like, again, pour it out, spill it out. That's what I'm feeling here. It's like, that, like, uh, like, but they, they're not right now. Okay. For some of you, but it's there and they want to. And I feel like they're going to wait on that right time where it feels like you're ready. It feels like you guys are there. It feels like you both have taken the time. Yeah. So very serious here. Okay. Now let's get a little more. Yeah. This person thinks about having a family with you, marrying you. This person may want to propose soon. That may be for some of you. Okay, wait, here we go. All right, home, sweet home, making a good home life or settling down. Taurus, marriage. Let me move my fingers so you guys can see. Marriage right there at the bottom, long lasting. This is the foundation. What I tell you, that's the focus here. Home, sweet home, where I want to be. The place that we've built together. Control. Taking responsibility for both actions and emotions. Stepping up. Steering. Someone's got to take control. Someone has to get in, get in that driver's seat and drive. But it's up to them. Someone may need to let someone know that they're no longer going to have control over who they see, what they do, how they go about what they want to do here. Again. Someone's taking back control. Someone wants to step up. That's that Aries Emperor energy here, right? Someone's like, I'm in control. I'm steering. I'm driving. I know what I want. I know where I'm going. And it leads to you, Taurus. Okay, let's get a little bit more. We're going to keep it going. You know how I do. <laughs> we have a lot of cards to get to. So, all right. For Taurus. Oh, can't let go. Won't let go. Uh, the direction here is just up, up, up. All I can see is just balloons just floating, but they're floating up. They're not going like moving. They're just rising up. This person feels like you are truly special. That there is no one like you. Ooh, needing to breathe. Very intense feelings here. Very intense emotions here. I feel like there's so much going on either around you or your person. Again, it could be the both of you that, that the obstacles here, that's what I'm talking about. The drama here, right? Whoever's causing these difference of opinions and issues. It's like someone just feels like, oh, I need to breathe. I need to get away, right? I need to take control. Someone here wants a break. All right, let's just be honest. I feel like there is a lot here that your person wants to talk to you about. They want to express their honest feelings, their deep feelings here. Okay. Someone here just needs a break from it all. Like there's something that they're just used to doing over. But look, it's like, this is the bottom here. This person is tired, like they're done. Again, please take it how it fits for you. This may be how you feel. You may be tired. You may be feeling like you need a break. You need time to breathe, right? You need time to get away from it while this person may need to work on what they need to work on. Okay, let's see. Yeah, guarded, cautious, afraid, right? There's that pullback. There's that hold up, wait. Let me, let me, let me peep you out. Let me see what's going on here. Very apprehensive. And this may just be the start, like how it went with the two of you. 
loyalty, dedication, trust, ooh, reliability. Yeah, this energy is coming through very strong in these cards, Taurus. This person is very loyal. This person is, they know how to keep their focus on their person, on you. Even if things kind of get like that smoke I was talking about or things get kind of muddied where, again, it creates hardship here, it creates challenges here. Look, look at that cute dog. It's like, you know, I'm, I know what I'm looking at. I know what I want. Like this person knows they want you. I just feel like they want to be free. I feel like they want to get away from the drama. They want you to know that you can trust them. They want to be someone you can rely on. There's a misunderstanding here. Someone playing the victim, someone who feels lost. There was a mistake made. Now, this is for those of you, something was done here that caused issues, okay? It caused a lot to happen. Uh, it caused the situation of where you and this person are at now. And I feel like this person is really starting to understand what not only what they've either damaged or hurt or the rift that they've caused here. But again, it's like this understanding is happening here. They feel lost without you. This is for those of you who may be separated because there is a lot of worry here. There's a lot of worry about not having my home, not having my peace, not having my happiness, not having that person that I want to either rebuild from the ground up or repair what I need to repair now. That's what it feels like here. All right, we have feminine energy on the bottom. Let's get a little bit more here. There's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful attraction here. That's the spark, the chemistry, that passion, undeniable. Uh, someone feels like they're being viewed wrong here. Like there's a big misunderstanding. Like there's something that's not clear, but it needs to be clear. Someone's kind of just standing around. It's almost like, okay, I'm just here. I'm a bystander. I just, what can I do? Like there needs to be a break. There needs to be space because feelings here are very intense here. But again, it's like still there's this preparing for a new phase here. So for a lot of you, this isn't over. For a lot of you, this is only just beginning. And someone really wants to step it up in a big way. Okay. Yeah. Reciprocate. Express shared feelings. There it is again. Those deep, deep cups. Those feelings here. Those things being held within. Let's look at the bottom. All right. Focus on what's in front, not behind. I feel like leaving the past where it needs to be in the past is very important here. I feel like there's a lot of expectations as well that you may have uh, for this connection, for this person, and they know it, they feel it, but they want to work on it. Okay. That's the feeling I keep getting. They just want to make this work because they don't want to lose you. So this person is thinking ahead. So it's like, again, they're thinking full speed ahead, but they're not rushing it here because they want you to know that, okay, look, I'm taking it serious this time. This is real. This is the real deal for me because it does feel like it feels like to them, you are truly someone unique, something rare. Let's get a little more. Let's see. Someone rare. Marriage material. Okay, what else? Yeah. Right now, I may feel like you're in the labyrinth here. Even when you feel lost, there is always a way through the labyrinth. There is always a way through the obstacles and challenges that we face, especially when you're coming together with someone, you have a partner, you're getting to know each other, right? You can find it. It's just, again, it's all about that patience. It's all about not panicking. It's all about, all right, let me figure out where I need to go. And I feel like that's where this person is at. They're not, they're not scared about being in this labyrinth. They're going to make it through because the goal is. Again, that happiness, that peace, that home, sweet home, being in control. To protect, to prepare, to plan, to rise up in this connection, in this love. 
A divine soul counterpart relationship is blessed with amazing moments of synchronicity. Things are going to happen when they're meant to happen. A lot of you might start to see signs when it comes to this person. You're always reminded about this person. But there is a beautiful blessed, like it just feels like, like that meant to be. There's a lot of dreams here. There's a lot of desires here. Share your dreams together and encourage each other to make them a reality. When you and this person come together the right way with each cup, right? That deep cup I keep talking about, there's nothing that you and this person can't do. No one can come between it. That's how powerful it is. Someone here is very sincere about you. It's like a beautiful romance here, but it's more than just that. That's just the beginning. Like I said, it feels like this is only just beginning here. There's so much more with the story with you and this person and where it goes, right? Preparing for that union, that marriage. All right, someone's in denial here. Someone's in denial. Someone keeps trying to reach forbidden paying attention to certain signs here okay because you may be dealing with someone here where again if it feels like the two of you just cannot get along and you in your gut you feel like it's time to move forward even though this person keeps trying to come back trying to persist if this person isn't showing you what you need to see then you may have your answer this just may be a door that is forbidden all right and that's just the way of the divine protecting you from going through this door through, through this path that leads to more hardship, more loneliness, right? More hard times, trying to make it out of the labyrinth, right? Needing to breathe, having that fresh air. You have beautiful moments here that are going to happen when they're meant to happen. And there's definitely a romance here. Someone who is sincere, someone who's going to share the feelings, share the values, share that dream of that home, sweet home. Never lose sight of that, whatever it may be for you. Whether you want marriage or not, whatever that home sweet home is to you. Let's see. <clears throat> okay. For Taurus. Someone is in deep thought here. Now, this could be you, Taurus. Having a lot on your plate, having a lot to think about here. Think about where to go. Think about how to reciprocate. If this person is going to give you what it is that you need, that you know you deserve. There's a tough decision here ahead. Right now, it feels like you guys have a lot of time to think here about the direction that you're headed here. And it may be you, Taurus, who feels like, okay, I need to get in the driver's seat here. I need to take control and I need to steer and head where I want to go, which is your happiness here. Someone who will reciprocate. Someone who's going to put time and thought into you, into this connection. I feel like there's a beautiful new beginning here. What else? All right, Taurus, turn on your heart light. Reflect on a time when you experience love. Some of you might be so guarded, so cautious here where that light isn't on. But there's someone here who, again, it's like, okay, look, the light may not be on, but I don't want to give up. I'll take the time. I'll do what needs to be done. Because when you do turn your heart light on, my goodness, there's so much here that's going to be expressed. <laughs> a lot of passion, a lot of fun, a lot of romance, but stability and trust and loyalty. So important, right? So important. And all this is on the table here. Reflect on when you experience love. And knowing that you will experience love again. This reading is really about... Not only preparing for union, Taurus, but the union of hearts, a love connection that defies explanation. Beautiful. 
All right. So yeah, when these two cups, your cup, their cup, when it comes together, it's unstoppable here. Solid, just like these two trees embracing each other, choosing each other. It's beautiful. All right. So Taurus, that's what I have for you. Thank you so much for watching you guys. Please like, subscribe, do all those wonderful things. Don't forget to hit that bell so you don't miss any upcoming videos. Sending you all love. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.